A COVID threw them a gutter ball, but with a little help, an East End bowling alley survived the pandemic, and now they want you to hit the lanes and get some strikes. We're taking you to the All Star in Riverhead. In tonight's, we're open. Bowling is very special. It's got such a strong attraction to so many people because it's the one thing you can do with every age group. My name is Chris Keller. I've been in the bowling business my entire life. My dad got me into bowling. I opened the All-Star in 2012. This place is a labor of love. The All-Star is a beautiful family entertainment center. We have 28 lanes of bowling. We have a six lane VIP room that's uh, great for parties and special events. We host leagues, fundraisers, and open play all the time. It's got a beautiful tiered sports bar, great food, great restaurants, Minnie's All-Star Grill, we call it. What else can you have fun together with? Enjoy some food, knock down some pins, have a great time. That's what makes me love bowling so much. We were a thriving business when we were shut down because of the pandemic. We were closed a, a full five months. We were lucky enough to be chosen by Barstool Sports. The Barstool Fund is a fund that was created by Dave Portnoy to help small businesses. They helped us with our mortgage for several months. When we were closed during the pandemic, we did a lot of things here to uh, modify the business, to be ready when we reopened. We brought in UVC light sanitizing stations for both the house balls and rental shoes. We upgraded our filtration system, everything we could to be prepared to reopen. We reopened August 17th of 2020. It's getting better and better and business is getting stronger and stronger. I can't even describe how wonderful the feeling is when you continue to support your business and people respond by coming back. I hope that people come here, get to see everything that we've created and really enjoy it and go home happy. It looks great. And we have more information about that business and a whole lot more on our website, news12.com. Click on the We're Open tab.